Welcome to my channel. I have been asked to react to, and I'm going to try to pronounce this, uh, it's the Danish National Girls Choir singing Nunc Dimittis. Uh, but the name of the channel is DR <laughs> Pins I can't pronounce it. It's P I G E K O R E T. I try, but I'm telling you, I'm I'm just not good with languages. You have to forgive me. So I'm gonna react to this now. It's a, a request that I got and I, I I'm fascinated. I want to hear the Danish National Girls Choir singing. But before we do that, I want to thank you for coming to my channel and for the fantastic requests that you make for stuff like this that I've never heard of before. I don't know anything about it, and yet it's, it's just exciting to me to get introduced to all these new things, and I really do appreciate it. As I do with every video that I make, I will go to their channel and I will get the links and I'll put them in the description. And you can click on the more link of my description and get those links. And what I ask you to do is to support these artists, all of the artists that I feature, by, by uh, subscribing to their YouTube channel, by following them on social media, and by buying their music if you like their music. So this is the Danish National Children's Choir singing Nunc Dimittis.
Well, <clears throat> I can tell you one thing. That took a lot of practice. I guarantee you that took a lot of practice because there was a lot of discordant sounds throughout the piece. And in order for you to sing those, you really have to practice because your, your ears can hear the discordance and you want to correct it. You want to change it to a major uh, chord and you can't because that's not how the music is written. And so, uh, you, you know, I mean, when you're singing in a choir like that, you can hear all the voices around you. And for you to, to keep your notes where they need to be, when your notes are clashing with other notes, really takes a lot of discipline. So uh, I'm impressed with the job that they did. That, that was not, that was a very difficult piece to sing. And they did it very well. They did it excellently. And <clears throat> some of the other thoughts I had, <laughs> I thought of monasteries in the Middle Ages and, and uh, monks singing and, and uh, uh, church the way it used to be when it was uh, very somber and not celebratory <laughs> at all. And uh, uh, many times when I sang in a choir, um, there, are a lot, there are a lot of songs that you can sing in a choir that, that are relatively easy to sing. If, if you can sing at all. Uh, but uh, when the when the notes are discordant like they were in this song, that that's tough. That is really tough. You have to be able to block out all the sounds around you and just sing your part. And for them to do that, I guarantee you they practice a lot and they're very good at what they're doing. So I'm impressed with the uh, Dutch National Girls Choir. That was that was impressive. Uh, thank you for coming to my channel, and I pray for you that you will have an abundant life, that you will live a long time, that you'll be healthy, and that God will keep you safe from harm. I pray that he'll do that same thing for every person that you love. But I pray most of all that you will be anxious for nothing, but in all things, through prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, you will make your requests known to God. And the peace that passes all understanding will keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. This is the Vietnam Era Vet, out.